Hello my dudes, welcome back to the channel. I'm really excited for today's video because I am partnering up with Spectrum FX to show you guys some really neat stuff. If you don't know, Spectrum FX is a brand owned by Brandon Aguilar who creates all these different types of filters and films just to make photography a little bit more interesting. And I actually followed them on Instagram a little bit ago and I was pleasantly surprised when Brandon sent me a message asking to do a video because I've wanted to try some of their filters for a long time. If you haven't watched that many of my videos before, I like to shoot a lot of experimental films. A negative thing about shooting experimental films is you have to shoot the whole roll with that effect on them. You know, like 36 or so straight exposures of that same effect. Whereas with a filter, you can take it on and off of your lens and basically use it with whatever film that you want, which is really awesome in my opinion, because it can be really hard using 36 straight exposures for one certain type of effect, you know, like, but it's, it's hard to do. We all know that can be hard to do. I don't have to explain it. Also with these filters, you can use it for a digital camera as well. You don't have to shoot a certain type of film, you know what I mean? Today the filter that I tried out is the prism filter and basically it creates these sort of rainbow type effects on the photo. When shooting with a filter like this, it's best to keep a open aperture, so like 1.8 to 5.6 say, that's going to give you the best effect. You will also get the best results shooting on a bright sunny day as opposed to maybe one that's cloudy. I was actually playing around with it with my digital camera and I pointed it at my ring light that I have here and it like duplicated the ring light which I thought was really cool. You can use basically any lens with this type of filter. Um, it would be best to use a wide angle just because more of the effect would be in the frame if that makes sense. It's also really fun for me to shoot video using this filter so I th definitely think I'm going to be using that in the future just to create some really cool effects to make things a little more interesting, you know what I mean? a lot better creating effects like this organically like in camera rather than you know using some sort of filter on an app or something it just first of all it's a lot more unique than just using a, an app and it's just I don't it turns out cooler and it's more fun you know what I mean <laughs> so now I'll share with you a couple photos I took on my Nikon FG film camera on Lamography 100 film, but I really like how dreamy they came out. I love a good dreamy photo. That's just my aesthetic. What can I say? <laughs> I really like the rainbow effect that you get from this filter. It looks really pretty in my opinion. Another nice thing about using filters as opposed to maybe an experimental film is when you shoot an experimental film, you've got that one film and then you have to buy another and another and another, whereas with a filter you can only buy the filter and you're good and you can use it on multiple cameras multiple lenses you know so that's also a more cost efficient way even though the cost up front might be more than buying one roll of film in the long run it's definitely going to be more cost effective anyway in this video I shot with the prism filter so feel free to check out their other filters as well Using filters in general is a fun way to spice up your photography and get inspired, you know, and get out of a rut if you feel like if you feel like you're kind of in a creative slump, if you know what I'm saying. The best of us, it happens to the best of us. I'll leave the link in the description so you guys can check it out and I will see you next time. Goodbye. Okay, More open Shooting at an app. Oh, fuck. Shooting at.
shooting at an open arbiter shooting at an open arbiter aperture you can use any lens you can you can use really any lens with these types of filters it's just it's you can use good job you did great you're a great model high five